It's confirmed, I'm wearing my hair up tonight. Actually, today, it kinda looks good, hold on. Hello, hello, this is day one. Yes, I am kneeling at a counter in a hotel in New York so that I can show you my hair. So, if you missed it, I will link it down below, but Lord have mercy. <laughs> I ended up doing this to my hair right before I hopped on a plane. Let me show you. It is a twist out with perm rods and then I put it back into a ponytail to kind of stretch my hair out and also I'm not in love with the style as it stands. My goal ultimately is to have a much fuller look. I have an event in two days here in New York and I want bigger hair. Just pulled up to the house. Don't feel like it now. I'ma just lay back and crack this window. go to bed looking like a three-year-old did my hair and that is okay good night welcome back to the Hyatt bathroom so <laughs> my hair actually is still in the same sort of banding style that I had last night I actually have not done my hair I've just taken this one out and put everything up in a ponytail so that I can make sure I could film without looking like a Rugrats character you know what I mean so now I'm going to be taking these bands out by the way I am vlogging my experience in New York so that you guys can all see it on my other channel Latoya Ebony I don't know. I am trying to give my hair a chance and I know somebody's gonna be like, that hey, looks great. And maybe in playback, I'll feel the same way. But I'm also still struggling with my seborrheic dermatitis and it is not being kind to me at all. I have flakes creeping up here and there, which means I'm just gonna have to wash my hair much earlier, which is fine because I'm gonna be um, doing an Amazon live. If you are not aware that I do Amazon live, I will post that link down below and I'll try to let you guys know when I'm doing them. So, oh, actually today, it kind of looks good. Hold on. Wait, maybe it just needed, oh, wait, wait, wait. Maybe it just needed the banding to kind of stretch the curls out a little bit. I just wanna show you guys up close what's going on. It's actually starting to look cute, but then there are some pieces that are ruined, so I don't know. Hmm. The back, ugh. I don't know. I'm loving the bang area. So I'm keeping all of my toiletries in this travel bag that I got from Amazon. It's actually a set of a bunch of bags. I'll be sure to link it. And my goal was to wear this scarf tomorrow over my head, but now I don't know. Let me see, I've got a little bit of a pick because I could maybe try to get some volume out of it. I actually don't really know how to fix this style, but I mean, I know eventually all of it's gonna work out. It always does. It's almost like I need to go one way or another, right? Either keep it super defined or just frizz everything out because this in-between stuff is just not working. I love the bangs though. I don't know, there's a couple of little pieces in the back that stretched a little bit too much, I think. So I'm gonna have to bobby pin them in order for the hair just not to look too crazy. Cause look, just hanging, I don't know. And of course, the more I pull it, the more ununified everything looks. What is this? Okay, so the verdict is to wear my hair out for today and then tonight I'm gonna just take a few of these pieces and recurl them. I actually brought a couple of perm rods with me just in case and I'm so happy I did. I have three perm rods. Mm. Like for example, this one right here is gonna have to be done over again. Like no matter what, this one's dead. And then there's like another little piece of something over here, you know, so I, I have three 
three, three, three pieces, three opportunities to fix. And then tomorrow I'm still gonna have to style it because it's still not styled. I still might wear it up, to be honest. I just, I think it might look really pretty up. But for now, let me just let it breathe and I will see you guys tomorrow. Oh, by the way, my hair feels very soft. I use the TPH leave-in conditioner and then the Deaf Mousse mousse <laughs> and my hair feels so bouncy it's shiny i also used some oil um i believe it was from carol's daughter i'm like at the end of the bottle and you know what it feels and looks really nice and shiny now all i need to do is style it but i'm gonna leave that for tomorrow tempo, tempo. You keep up with my tempo? So my hair ended up settling quite nicely. This side is definitely more stretched than the other side. So I think what I'm gonna do is a high pony and then I'm gonna kind of twist this one again, just wetting it with tap water. And then I'm going to twist, just kind of recreating what I did before. If my camera dies, I'm basically gonna pineapple my hair doing the same technique that I did for the rest of my hair on this one little twist here so that it's not the odd one out tomorrow. Hopefully it sets by morning. And then the front, I'm actually not going to do anything to because I don't, I don't want to pull more. And because I kind of like where things are headed with it, oops, I said I wasn't gonna pull the front more. Because I like where things are headed, I'm not gonna make this too, too tight. Just gonna pineapple and let Jesus take control. <laughs> I give it to God. Yeah, that's it. It's gonna look like that. In the front, I'm not going to do anything to, and I'm just gonna put this bonnet on, wash my face, and go to bed and we can only hope for the best tomorrow at this point. And then tonight I'll end up pulling this down so it doesn't like rub against my edges, but for now I'm gonna wash my face and then head to bed. I'll see you tomorrow. Welcome to another day. My girl Kay is somewhere in the background if you see her. <laughs> um, so this little perm rod I put in my hair last night, wet my hair a little bit and look it. Yeah, oh, hair still feels soft. There was definitely enough product left to do the job and moisturize quick anyway. So I'm happy about that. And now the moment of truth. See, now this one looks all defined. The moment of truth. I'm gonna let my hair down for the next few hours and then, you know, we'll see. We'll see if I'm gonna wear it down, if I'm gonna wear it up. My hair smells like the hair, pro the TPH hair products, which is like a very, very, very strong, like perfumey. I don't even know, like literally, I can't tell if it's a floral. I can't tell what it, what the scent is. It just smells like cologne. <laughs> like it's not even like florally, you know, light kind of feminine scent. No, it is a deep, cologne scent and i honestly i don't know what to do about it but if the only thing that would deter and it sucks because the conditioner the tph conditioner is really good <laughs> but the smell is so strong like to the point like i'm putting on fragrance i can't even smell my okay i can smell my own perfume but it's just it's just it, it it overpowers you like you have to really like the smell and it's not to say that it's a bad smell it's just if you're a person who First of all, it doesn't like fragrance. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. You don't get this. It works so well. Like her products work. It just sucks that they're so fragrant. Okay, the back feels like it's struggling, but you guys can let me know. I guess I'll see it in post. I don't know. I feel like the back is struggling. It feels like the back feels like it's struggling. It is, right? I might have to wear my hair up tonight. Yeah. Yeah. It's confirmed. I'm wearing my hair up tonight. Damn. Damn. All right. <laughs> Thank you.
Okay, so now that my hair is up in a uh, French twist, I'm gonna take a scarf, a scarf that I think looks pretty good with this. And I don't know if I wanna do this way. I think I'm gonna do this way. And then see if I can get this to work. Okay, I think it probably, I think it probably looks decent. Oh, so this is pretty much the finished look. Curls up. This is as good as it's gonna get, <laughs> but I like it. It's classy. It's up. It's curl. I don't know what day we're on, but that's where we're at. I'm back home from New York City. <laughs> I had an amazing time on my trip and I have a full vlog coming on my second channel, LaToya Ebony, where I do fashion, beauty, and lifestyle vlogs, pretty much everything else that I'm about um, on that channel. I, all you have to do is search LaToya Ebony or I will leave that direct link down in my description box. I am very excited because I think it's gonna be a good and juicy vlog. I was there for an event with Amazon. We were celebrating being black creators and black businesses and it's something that I'm all about. So um, it was a great time. So I'll post that link down below. I have a lot to catch up with on that channel. So it will eventually come. It will come, okay? So if you like vlogs, if you like fashion, if you like beauty, Speaking of beauty, I've been testing a bunch of new beauty products. This one's from Euphoria. It's called Coral Fixation. And as you can see, it's a very natural look. I have not put foundation on my face today because I'm going to the gym. That being said, let's get into a hair update and then I will share the haul to close everything out, okay? And I'm very excited about those products. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so <laughs> this is my hair. It has been in this hairstyle for about two to three days now. This is day seven, I believe, and I'm going to wash my hair because my scalp really needs it. I think I mentioned it before in my clarifying hair routine, but that I'm going to have to kind of wash with a medicated shampoo a few times for everything to clear up. And of course, when you come back from a trip like New York and you're eating a bunch of Caribbean food and bread and pasta and sugar, the journey becomes a little bit longer. So I know better, but also I was on vacation, so... <laughs> Allow me this one, okay? Um, so I still have to do some rehab on my scalp, but let me tell you, the combination for these curls, I will show you on screen what the exact products I use were for this hair tutorial and it did not disappoint, okay? The mousse was moussing and the fact that I still have curl definition after all of this time and it's just now getting to the good part. You know, I do not want to wash my hair at all because I still feel that I could stretch it for three more days and get another hairstyle out of this. However, my scalp is, is telling me to, to hang it up. You know, we gotta listen to Zoe sometimes. Zoe is the name of my hair. I used to say it like all the time and sometimes I like pop it in here for those of you who are new. Hello, this is Zoe. She's fire. She's all that, okay? She's all that, a bag of chips. She's a chameleon. She is gorgeous and she is 4C and amazing. So um, I really love my hair over here, okay? <laughs> and I love the versatility and the different things that I can do with her. But um, my hair looks really good. I just kind of did a French roll um, in the back, I mean the front, the top, instead of like having it out like I did, it started looking a little raggedy. So I took some straight pins and kind of pinned it down a little bit so it looks a little bit neater and um, put this headband on and have the bangs out. And this is kind of how I am closing things out. <laughs> Now let's get into this haul. Let's get into the haul. When I did the 30 day hair detox, I was introduced to a bunch of new brands. One of them being 
I almost dropped that. One of them being AG Care. And you guys have seen this bottle a million and one times on my channel. Well, me and the brand have been kind of chatting back and forth on Instagram. And they saw how much I loved this AG Balance because it has apple cider vinegar. Of course, it's great for my scalp. I love it. And it doesn't strip my hair, it's amazing. They were like, hey, we have some new eco-friendly packaging and we want to share it with you. And so I said, yeah, great. And also I'm interested in another line. They ended up sending me like 12 products, you guys. It's insane. So let's get into it. The AG Balance Shampoo has a new look. It's aluminum and it's so chic. It looks so good. I love how the pump is much wider at the top. Cause you know, when your hands are slippery, sometimes like if the top is way too skinny, it just slips right off, right? This one I never had a problem with, but this one is even better. Look at the difference. Look at the difference. And look at how, ooh, sexy this bottle looks. It looks so good. I love it. Same great formula. And they hooked me up with the conditioner too. So this is the Boost conditioner. It also has apple cider vinegar in it. It's silicone free. This one's sulfate free. So they are a perfect pair. And they gave me refillables. Oh my goodness, guys. There is enough shampoo and conditioner to last me all year and plus, okay? So I will be sharing with my husband. Um, he loves the packaging as well. He is a designer. He's a he's a packaging guy. And he was like, yeah, I'll totally borrow that. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I have plenty, of course. So this is the Curl Fresh line. It comes in the same packaging as the Balance and the Boost. It is called Curl Fresh Curl Enhancing Shampoo with P and rice complex for moisturized and defined curls. And the second one is Curl Fresh Coconut Avocado Conditioner. Coconut and avocado oils for healthy and happy curls. The conditioner is what made me want to try it. Um, just coconut, you guys know I love coconut. Okay, I'm a coconut oil girl. <laughs> and um, avocado, which I have tried on my hair once before and I'd rather have it packaged. I'm, I'm, <laughs> you better blend your life into that bowl because honestly, you don't want those chunks in your hair. But um, avocado just has like a very smoothing, like heavy, just, mm, I love avocado. I love avocado oil. I love everything avocado. So coconut avocado, that's what made me want to try this conditioner. By the way, I am thinking of bringing hair care favorites back to um, this channel, as well as on my second channel, LaToya Ebony. Um, that's gonna be more fashion beauty favorites. Hair care is gonna stay over here. Um, I have a ton of products and I really wanna get better at trying them, it's like trying new things basically trying the things that I have, <laughs> okay? Because I tend to get stuck on one thing for a very long time, which is not necessarily a bad thing, but you know, I don't want things to expire either. So it looks like they have different lines that they gave me and there's different colors. So I'm assuming that this stuff kind of goes together. So this is the Recoil Curl Activator, defines curls, seals in moisture, and is silicone free. So I'm definitely gonna look more into this and see, this is probably really good for like a wash and go. Oh, I'm gonna find out. <laughs> and then this is Liquid Effects Extra Firm Styling Lotion, defines curls, high shine, alcohol free, incredible shine and humidity resistance, alcohol free styling lotion. Okay, okay, this is a lotion and this is more of a cream. So, hmm. I'm assuming that this will have a more firm hold than the cream, um, but you know, only time will tell. By the way, as I am going through this, know that all of the links will be down below for you to check out, um, see if you like anything, purchase if you'd like. And also I want you guys to be thinking about like what you really want me to try. And also like if you've tried something and it's bay please let me know, cause that's gonna alert me that I need to try it, okay? <laughs> so this is another one in the green packaging that kind of matches the Curl Fresh line. This is called Curl Fresh Definer Silicone Free Soft Hold Styling Cream, Sweet Almond and Olive Leaf for Smooth, Nourish and Shiny Curls. So this is a soft hold styling cream. So, so far it looks like we have like a soft, a medium and like an extra firm hold. So very, very interesting. I see a leave on conditioner. 
hydrate hair, manage frizz, lightweight. Okay, so we know what a leave-on conditioner is and I can probably use this with just about anything here, possibly. I'm gonna make sure I read instructions beforehand. Instant feed, smooth and calm dry or coarse hair with smoothing and calming aloe. Hmm, okay. I have two more products. Next is the oil, extra virgin argon smoothing oil, soften hair, high shine, lightweight. So it's an oil, I like the packaging. It is different. I usually can see through the bottle and this one I can't. So I think that that's pretty interesting. Cool, it has like a little pump bottle there. Okay, okay. And then this is the most interesting thing. Vita C Serum, vitamin C strengthening sealant, reduce breakage, smooth and shine, soften hair, increase elasticity, help seal split ends and get a soft glossy finish with this leave-in serum enriched with vitamin C. Ideal for dry or damaged hair, apply to damp hair and blow dry or air dry. Very interesting, indeed. <laughs> special, special shout out to AG Care for sending these products my way. Again, comment down below, have you tried anything? Are you interested in me trying any of these? Like which is sparking your interest the most? Leave it down below so that I know, so that I can consider it for my trials in the upcoming months. And check out my other channel, Latoya Ebony, as well as check out my Amazon Live. So I'm actually about to do a live twisting or a live twist out on Amazon Live and you're able to ask me questions back and forth as I'm doing it live, which is something I actually haven't seen. I actually have never done. And I, I don't know about all the other creators on Amazon Live, but it's definitely something that I wanna bring, okay? And so I'm very excited about that. The live stream will have already happened by the time you see this, but I am doing more um, on different topics, whether it's hair care, fashion, beauty, home, whatever, there'll be others and it'll all be like Amazon um, products. I just wanna let you guys know, you can go down in the description box and also follow me there. So I've got a lot for you down in the description box. Take your time. I appreciate the support as always. And um, this is the end of a week in my hair. I'm about to wash my hair and my next style is going to be a twist out, but I'm doing that live and um, you know, Y'all will see it in the video, okay? <laughs> How everything turns out. I love you all and I thank you for the support. And go check out everything else. Okay, I'll see you in a day or two, a Monday or a Thursday. <laughs> Let me just like, hold on, hold on. That being said, I will see you on a Monday or a Thursday and I'm out. Mwah.